smartwatch, fitness tracker, or not sure what you really need? I'm here to help you out with everything you need to know when it comes to buying a wearable. Fitness trackers have smaller screens than smartwatches, but the battery often lasts a lot longer. Now these are best if you want something slim, unobtrusive, and to do more simple tasks, just like tracking steps and getting notifications from your phone. Fitbit is the name you've probably heard most here with options at different prices, but I also really like the Mi Band as a budget option around $50. Then you have general smartwatches, usually in the region of around 300 to 500 US dollars. Now that's anything from the Apple Watch, Galaxy Watch, and Pixel Watch, while brands like Fitbit and Mobvoi also have options that fall into this category. Budget smartwatches also exist under $250, but they won't have as many bells and whistles. For example, the Apple Watch SE doesn't have an always-on display. You can even get lesser-known brands like Amazfit watches for less than $100. Now there are some trade-offs with sensor accuracy, but maybe you don't really mind. Mind.